Yes, so I, the, there are many motivations for coming to Zimbabwe, but I think the main motivation is just the uh, the idea of finding somewhere that still has retained a lot of magic, or that's what we, we like to think of it when we're uh, viewing it from the UK. Um, <coughs> catch my breath because he just climbed up <laughs> um, so uh, and, and I think that's really important I mean we live in a big urban metropolis in London and sometimes it's good to get somewhere where you can reconnect with yourself and a place that's kind of kept and retained a lot of its natural beauty uh, it's very important um, so it's really an opportunity to connect with that in nature but also the people and to understand also a culture that we maybe has been I would say denied us for a long time and now it's a great opportunity uh, with lifting of sanctions and things like that to uh, to explore all that and also come at a time when people are also finding new opportunities to uh, rediscover themselves so it's a, a sense of i guess in a nutshell i say it was, it's a chance to reconnect with yourself and also to reconnect with uh, a culture and a country that has um, been off the radar for, for a long time